On Saturday, November 1st, the Kutztown University Golden Bears host its final home game of the 2014 season in a matchup against the Lock Haven University Bald Eagles. In a ceremony before the kickoff, 13 players were honored for Senior Day, most of whom would be starters for that game. The temperatures would prove to be damp and drizzly, but that did not stop the Golden Bears from playing their hearts out. Kutztown hoped to continue their winning streak after the previous week's victory against the East Stroudsburg University Warriors. Early in the first quarter, Kutztown was poised to punt the ball, but because of a late hit on punter Andrew Deutsch by Lock Haven's Jeff Dincher, it result in a first down for the Golden Bears. This led to a 34-yard pass to Nathan Hollander from Chad Barton for KU touchdown. Later in the first quarter, Kutztown went three and out and punted the ball to Lock Haven. The ball was then touched by Kyler Gallishaw and was recovered by Drake Brumfield. This led to a 16-yard touchdown run by Terry Williams. In the start of the second quarter, the KU Bears moved the ball steadily through the air and got to the one-yard line. KU went three and out on Lock Haven's one-yard line, resulting in a KU field goal. From that point on, the Golden Bears struggled on offense. The second half was a defensive battle between Lock Haven and Kutztown until Zach Delp caused the safety in the fourth quarter. Delp's 13 tackles, four tackles for loss, and safety earned him the title of PSAC Defensive Athlete of the Week. Preseason All-American defensive end Zach Greenwall also achieved the milestone by making five tackles, increasing his career high to 202 tackles. The final score was 19-0, marking the second Golden Bears shutout victory of the season. The following Saturday, the Golden Bears would travel to Shippensburg University to face off against the Red Raiders.